Hi y'all. Look at Brandon. Trying to be sleek. He's waiting. <laughs> He's looking for a way to get into this lady's parking. So we're gonna wait till she leaves. It's a madhouse out here. No, one, no one's taking this parking. Yet. <laughs> Good luck. Mm -hmm. But yeah, we're having Sunday brunch. We just got out of church. He googled this place, uh -huh. and it's uh, what's it called? Something toast. Uh, the fa the famous toastery. So so I guess we'll see how famous it really we'll is. We'll see. But I I, we'll I mean we came here yesterday and I talked about how packed it was when I came the first time, and he's like, oh. What's the rave about? Oh, he got the spot, he got the spot. Can you, your car is big though. Yeah, we're gonna make it work. I'm scared. <laughs> oh, rough ride over here. All right, made it work. I got a lot of space on my side. I well, got the other place is good. Okay. Too. Alrighty. Got to take my glasses off. I'm ready to eat. You're in party mode? I'm party mode, I'm ready. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Yeah, the bridal boutique I came to try on stuff at is right here. I loved it, but it was extremely expensive. Do you want to sit inside or outside? I am wearing a thick sweater because your church is always cold. Uh, we can sit inside. Just okay. Play by ear. All right. Uh, so bad news. Yeah. That's why those ladies were leaving. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they are so full that we cannot. They turned us away. They turned us away. They close at three. It's only twelve thirty. Brandon, it's because I'm black. And they turned us away. <laughs> I mean, you would think that, like, on a Sunday, their yeah. most popular day, they would know to account for all the people that they're gonna get, but I guess not, even though they've been in business for decades. Yep. So, it's whatever. I'm just watching the people that went in after us. I'm like, if they don't come out right now, it means they took them and they didn't take us. See why I like Original Pancake House? Mm -hmm. Original Pancake House doesn't turn you away, they yeah. just tell you there's a little it's bit of a never been turned away from Original Pancake House. There's a little bit of a way, but we can, you know, they usually, and we have this app now where we don't even have to go there. We can just get in line on the app. Mm -hmm. How cool is that? I don't know what that app is called anymore, no but. No wait. No wait, yeah. yeah. So from your like church, you could get in line mm -hmm. and then you could just kind of skip the line when you get there and it gets, it sends you a message saying you're, it's your turn or something. So anyway, it's hot. It's like 84 degrees, it feels like. Mm -hmm. And it's humid and I'm wearing a sweater. So I say we try somewhere else and we go home. My God, her steering wheel has bling gauge on it. Ooh. Anyway, we'll all right, let's else. try somewhere else or go home. So we changed our minds. <laughs> no more brunch. We're heading to another brunch location. And then we changed our mind where we ended up getting what, Indian? Indian food. So Coopers. why not come somewhere where they had seats for us? <laughs> mm -hmm. And if you can see the parking lot, they have plenty of seats. They please. have plenty of seats. That's a nice little Tesla right there. Oh, you guys can't see it but there's a lot of Teslas in Charlotte. I don't know, it's a Tesla market here. But yeah, we're gonna go see, you know, where we can get. I want a nice seat. <laughs> I don't want some food. <laughs> so heading in, everybody in the restaurant can probably see us vlogging. Probably. It always looks weird. Look at that car. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> Love it. in here waiting for our food and Brandon starts telling me how he stayed at a haunted place because he thinks what if this place is haunted really though so anyway he's gonna tell you guys the story because I'm not trying to hear it so, uh, I was in Dallas staying at a hotel and it was haunted before I got there but I was like you know whatever might as well try it out What's the one? you know probably never gonna happen Hotel, but I can't sleep for some reason. Like, I can't, I just can't go to sleep all the nights I was there. And one night in particular, I was like laying in bed, sleeping, and kind of like couldn't move. And it was like I could look around, but I couldn't move. And while I'm sleeping, I see like this 
dark thing like coming towards me and I'm like freaking out like I can't move I can't do anything and it's just coming toward me it's getting closer and closer and then I wake up and the creepy thing is that I wake up in the same position as I was in my dream and everything looked the same it was like it was like I was still asleep but I wasn't mm. like, it was really creepy yeah, I think you just had a dream. <laughs> you, just, you freaked yourself out because they told you it was haunted and you were expecting an, uh, some kind of experience. Uh, Where was this hotel? In Dallas. So it's a Hyatt in Dallas? No, no, it was just a boutique hotel. It used to be a. So the owner, funny thing about the hotel, the hotel is like 150 years old, mm -hmm. but the owner. So they've had two weird things happen in the hotel. Um, so the owner had a mistress, and he could keep his mistress in the top floor of the hotel. And one day he was going up to see her, and he fell down the stairs. And died. Yeah. Wow. And then people have been killed there as well. What was it like? Lovely, and you chose that hotel to stay at. Yeah. You wanted some drama. Yeah. And you got it. Kudos. <laughs> Creepy. Yeah. Kudos. Yeah. Okay, our food is really late. It's here. So as we're about to give up on the food, here it is. Well, well I don't have yours isn't yet, here. But, but I got my rice and I got my lamb. But I guess they like her better than me. No, but it's been 30 minutes and even the naan didn't come out. Nothing, no appetizer. Yeah, so hopefully that'll come out soon. Jeez. It wasn't this long last time, so I'm like a little irritated. But I'm really hungry. Me too. And I also know there's nobody inside. There's only one couple inside. So this food could have come. I can't eat without him getting his, so we're just gonna wait. Okay, so I got the Mer Tikka Marsala. What'd you get, Toby? Something lamb. Not sure, but it's curry. Mm -hmm. Lamb curry, but it's a different funky name. Mm -hmm. It and looks good. I'm ready to dig in. I was waiting for these 30 minutes ago, so we could kind of keep us going, but mm -hmm. we finally got. Time to eat. Again. What do you think the bill is? Thirty-five twenty. No, 35.82. I'm sorry, we're doing this to the cents today? 35.82. I'm thinking it is. You said 35? I'm saying 30. Okay. We'll see who's closer. Let's see who's right. Okay. Drum roll, please. Let me see. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? I can't get it 40. to. What is it? 40? Yeah. Oh my god, I was wrong. Crap. <sighs> okay, so we just finished our meal. The food was really good. I took the food a while to get here, but overall, I'll give them a. I'll give them a 4.65 out of 5. They gave you free rice. Any, okay, so I'll give them a 4.7 out of 5. <laughs> so, which is really good. We told him we wanted rice to go, and he was mm -hmm. like, okay. And he went and packed rice to go for us, and then he still brought rice to the table. Mm -hmm. Most places I've been to charge you for yeah. rice, like nickel and dime you. They were just a little slow. That was my only complaint. It took us a long time to get our food. But um, I would highly recommend this place. It's really good. The food is really good. On another note, Toby's driving right his car. Slightly <laughs> scared. Whoop, whoop, whoop. But we'll see how this goes. Good lord, it's hot. I'll talk to y'all later. <laughs> assuming that we make it home. Oh my god. Well, anyway, we're we're heading home, okay. and I'm excited. I'm driving his car. Trust me enough. <sighs> okay, let's do okay. this. <clears throat> Bye guys. Okay. Needless to say, I did not kill Brandon. I drove the car safely, parked one time, I was good to go, okay? Because I know how to drive. <laughs> but yeah, no, um, parked the car okay, we're home safely. But I just wanted to end the vlog properly, and thank you for hanging out with us this Sunday. I'm alive. He's alive. <laughs> Bye.